It's 4.30 a.m. on a Monday in Los Angeles, the 17th of January, 1994, a holiday in honor of the birth of Martin Luther King Jr. Suddenly, a blind thrust fault ruptures below the surface. The fault pushes upward 11 feet to the north in a magnitude 6.7 earthquake. San Fernando Valley isn't just shaken, it's both uplifted and shaken. Buildings fail, parking garages collapse, bridges buckle, brick buildings become rubble, hillsides slide, gas lines rupture, fires break out, water pipes break, electricity distribution is disrupted. Construction codes to ensure structural integrity of buildings during ground motion are insufficient in many areas. Damages will exceed $20 billion, 9,000 people will be injured, 57 will die. A sobering event, but had the earthquake happened during working hours, when schools, stores, and offices were occupied, the death toll would have been much higher. This magnitude 6.7 earthquake occurred next to the magnitude 6.6 .6 San Fernando earthquake in 1971. Both were thrust fault movements. It is probable that more thrust fault movements will occur in your lifetime.